Hi everybody, welcome to Daisy. Welcome to PC Daisy. Um, welcome to Chernogorsk. Uh, we're at the top of one of the big buildings uh, on Chernorus. And this video is kind of solving sort of two things for me. It's a bit of a technical test of recording gameplay and audio at the same time on my new uh, Lenovo uh, T5 gaming PC. And also to share some thoughts on what it's like playing Daisy on a rig that can fire out 140 frames a second at uh, 1440p at uh, the highest settings so yes that's pretty amazing so one of the reasons for having a, uh, a gaming rig is to make my uh, video production process much more efficient and basically faster as well um, and one of the ways I can do that is by having a system whereby I can record gameplay and audio at the same time so the way that I'm recording this video now is I'm um, on the Lenovo, it's um, recording the gameplay, uh, and the NVIDIA GeForce experience is recording the gameplay, and it's also adding in the audio, which I'm saying at the same time. And you may say, well, that sounds pretty obvious, Rob. But yeah, but I couldn't do that before. Um, I couldn't do it with the Xbox or with the Shadow Cloud gaming PC, because with the Xbox, it won't record gameplay and audio at the same time. So I'd have to record the audio uh, on my uh, laptop, and then record the video on the SSD for the Xbox and then bring them both into post-processing um, and then sync them together and then render them and then upload them. And on the Shadow Gap Cloud Gaming PC, I couldn't record audio at the same time because the audio would go all crackly because it goes over the, it goes over the internet. Um, so I'd have to record it separately, upload it to my Shadow Cloud Gaming PC and again in post-processing, I would have to, um, uh, I'd have to sync them. Um, uh, the only time I've really been able to record stuff um, uh, where I record the audio and the video at the same time is on my PlayStation 4. That was very good at that. Uh, you could just play a game and talk over it and the PlayStation would record what you were saying and you could upload that straight to YouTube. And also when I do simple uh, screen broadcasts using OBS on my laptop as is, not using it as part of the Shadow Glen Cloud Gaming PC, but just using it as it is it with a... Um, uh, screen capture OBS set at like 15 frames a second and, and I can do that so this seems to be working okay and for this video I'm also the way I'm doing it is the mic I'm using is my USB mic um, which should have significantly better audio qualities than my uh, HyperX headset mic which I have when I use that I have it plugged into my Xbox controller which I used on the previous cyberpunk video which is basically talking about the same sort of the same same ideas so it seems to be working okay uh, with a lot of these things with this um, workflow process it's just really getting the mechanics in place of doing it so that when I want to make a video I can just um, do it uh, fairly fairly simply but this looks um this looks pretty amazing so that seems to be very good very very pleased so next thing what's it like playing daisy at 140 frames a second 1440p and i've got to say it's pretty amazing in fact being up here on top of this building and then looking down because the frame rate is so high when i do that when i kind of move the camera fast and you get a bit of parallax going with the building so you get that sense real sense of depth i get a little bit dizzy i get i get vertigo I do looking over this edge here not, not when I kind of do that but if I move the camera a bit so we get a bit of get a bit of parallax I go whoa now you won't be whoa uh oh uh oh uh oh Ooh. ah that wasn't a very good idea was it um respawn here we go um you won't be really able to see this because I can only capture the video at 60 frames a second so you're not getting that you know that over 120 frames a second um, that, that I can kind of see. Um, so it's very, very impressive indeed. It's very, very clear. It's very, very fast. It's very, very immersive, I guess, is the is the thing I would say. is um, Like this tree here, the because it is so smooth as you're running past it, the jerking, that's just me. My, in fact, if I change the sensitivity of my mouse, can I make it a bit smoother? Yeah, it's really, it's, it's my lack of smooth movement uh, with my mouse that's really causing um any issues with it looking jerky um and it really is uh, yeah it is absolutely amazing absolutely fantastic now i don't want anybody going away though thinking that say daisy on the xbox series s is is significantly worse it's just different um when you when you move up from say uh an xbox original xbox or xbox uh, one s 
to the One S, you go from 30 frames a second to 60 frames a second. Now that is a massive improvement. Um, and I would say, you know, that, that is very, very good. Um, going this to, to a high-end gaming PC, where we're going up to over 120 frames a second um, with a rock steady 1440p resolution. Obviously, it's another step up, but you know, when I go back and play on my uh, Daisy on my Xbox Series S, I don't go, oh, this looks rubbish. You know, uh, all this frame rate is slow because, f as far as I'm concerned, as soon as you start getting up above 40 frames a second, 50 frames a second, it all looks very, very, very good. You know, and 60 frames a second, it all looks looks very, very good. And then what this rig guard does, um, it really just makes it so that it's like the icing on the cake of being incredibly fast, incredibly high resolution, um, and just looks really cool. So have I said already? So yeah, so this is a Lenovo Legion T5, which runs an AMD Ryzen 7 with an RTX 3070, two ter terabyte hard disk drive with a one terabyte SSD, which Daisy is running off. Um, and what I will do is I will put a... Um, I'll put a link to it in the video uh, in the description below this video if you fancy kind of checking it out. Uh, but yeah, I've been very, very impressed. So technically, recording gameplay and audio at the same time seems to be a, a doer, which means I can do things much, much faster. And you know, playing Daisy at this um, sort of resolution and this quality and this frame rate is um, it is something else. Anyway, that's enough for me. What do you think? Put your questions and comments down below. If you like the video, hit like. If you want to do the same, press subscribe. And I will, of course, see you again soon.